There have been huge developments along the galactic front, Helldivers. From the Terminant front to new orders on the Automaton front. A crazy new weapon leak along with other patches. There's always action on the front lines of Helldivers 2. To begin with, since last week, our commanding major has given the order to take over the planets Fori Prime, Estanu, Grimzika, and Hellmire. Two of these four planets, Fori Prime and Estanu, have already been liberated at the inception of the major order, so we expected it to be an easy one for you Helldivers, especially considering the weekend rush to deployment. Secondly, last week we noticed crashes have been a problem for our Helldivers, and this was primarily due to the use of electric weapons. This includes the Arc Thrower, Arc Shotgun, and Tesla Tower. When used after a certain amount of time, they tend to cause our soldiers to freeze up during the mission, rendering them unable to liberate and continue playing. We believe this to be caused by the overtuned electromagnetic waves amplifying on the inside of our helmet material. More on that later. Before we continue on, soldiers! 99% of you are not subscribed! It would be a huge favor to a growing channel if you hit that like and subscribe button down below. Thank you and continuing on with the news. Since last week, we have taken over Crimsica and Hellmire. It just goes to show that the incredible hard work that our Helldivers have done to liberate our galaxy and wrest back control from the Terminate Scum will not cease. Let's hope that now that this major order is complete, we will regain access to our lost privileges since failing our previous major order. With an update on the electric weapons, we have a new patch from our equipment manufacturer. From now on, our supplier has fixed the issue with game freezes during missions with this new patch. Current sources are saying that our helmets are now being fabricated with a new dampening material that should stop our brains from melting. The manufacturers have assured us that there is no reduction of quality to our helmets and they should work just as fine as before. Not like they did much before anyways, am I right, buddies? Ha <laughs> And now for the news that you've been waiting for, breaking news segment. Recent transmissions have caught wind of a huge automaton offensive wave being planned. The target? Super Earth. Your home planet, where you, your nation, and your family reside. They seem to be calling it the Reclamation. In order to protect ourselves, we will be launching a defensive preemptive attack on their planets. Our Helldivers will push deep into the enemy's planetary territory and retake Troost. But it's not as simple as it sounds, Helldivers, because we do not currently have the strategic means to reach Troost. Therefore, in a matter of a few days, we will have to enact this attack plan. We will gain a toehold into the territory with Ustotu, where we will gain further strategic advantage on Vandalon 4. From there, we need to make a last push into Troost and protect our homeworld from invasion. It should be simple, Helldivers. You know what to do. Get into your Hellbots and get to work. For your personal order mission, you will need to break out the defensive stratagems again because you need to get 40 kills with the anti-personnel minefield. There will be loads of mines placed everywhere, so keep your eyes peeled and watch your steps, soldiers. And for the love of Super Earth, at least call out where you send your mines after you throw it, Helldivers. Over the weekend, a new leak has been posted. If you're not interested in seeing leaks, skip to the next chapter to avoid getting spoiled. There have been leaks of a new heavy machine gun being introduced in the game. Exciting stuff, Helldivers, and here's a video to go with it.
Now for a meme break. Hopefully you soldiers won't have to view like this user posted on Reddit. Oh shit. I'm guessing all the viewfinds into the night here to see the Mishan Lords. Eh? Jeez. The whole goddamn playground is here, yes? As our Mishan should be launched with an audience. Now, ladies, can lap. And now for a helpful tip, it seems there's some confusion as to what this hole on Terminate Planets is for. If you throw a grenade into it, it will trigger a huge geothermal blast of heat, killing any enemies nearby, including Bile Titans. It will not work with impact grenades, however, so be careful, Helldivers. That's all the news we have time for today. Good luck and liberty save you taking over those automaton planets.